Hey YouTube, I Bright Apps here, and today I'm going to be doing my 15th tutorial. And today it's actually going to be another quick tutorial, and it's, it's going to be on how to change like the name of your Xcode project while you know, say you're still working on it, and you just want to name it something else, and the name uh, change the name of a thing like an uh, of an individual class file, because you know if you want to change the name of a class file, usually like in the older Xcodes, like in three or whatever it was. You would have to just manually do everything, but now there's a new way, and it makes it a whole lot easier. So, first off, I named it Test App. It was a single view application, and I'm just going to name it something else. So, what you're going to do is I'm going to go back here. So, I'm going to click the App Delegate first, for example. Click this once. Now, click this, and then you're able to change it. So, then I'm going to type in Game App, or you can name it whatever else you want. So, you click Enter. And now it's going to say rename project content, content items. And you're going to make sure everyone's clicks. So and most likely you're not going to have to change anything here. So this will pretty much rename everything for you. Um, no. Or if you want to, you can do that. Now go back. You'll see that your uh, your view controllers and stuff are still like not changed or whatever. Or if you want to change it individually. What you're going to do is you're going to go to your dot .h. You're going to double click this in the dot in, after the at interface. You're going to double click this so the whole view controller, the name, is updated. I mean, um, like it has a blue uh, box around it. Then you're going to right click. You're going to go to refactor, then the refactor, and then go to rename. And I will name it game app view controller. Now click preview. And you'll see this little like window will come up here within Xcode, and it'll say this. It will pretty much just like have like a a little image of what it will look like from. And this is before, and I guess this yeah this is afterwards. Or oh, actually no, this is before, and this is afterwards. So then we want to leave everything clicked here most likely. And once you know everything looks good to you, just click save, and that's it. Then it's renamed, and then you, this only does one class. Like um, it'll do the .h and .m and the .xiv at a time, but you can't like change all of them, you know, at the same time. Whatever, you know, that makes sense. So um, yeah, today was just a quick little tutorial. Tomorrow I will be doing another tutorial. I believe tomorrow, no, Monday concludes my tutorial week. So I think this is going to be my fifth tutorial of the week. So um, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you found it useful. And remember to comment, rate, and subscribe. See you.